We have BlackRock saying big default warning. Nothing to worry about here. Also, articles are saying this is a Lehman Brothers 2 moment or worst since Lehman Brothers. And even Ray Dalio is saying burn this mother down. Hold on. Yes, Skylar. The oh, boss, that's clearly not what he says. And you wonder why no one respects you here. Read read the teleprompter. Can't stand your comedy. Well, I can't. That's a dirty word. You have such serious information, but the people I try and turn you on to discredit you because of it. I, I will listen because of how on top of this you are. Go cry somewhere else. We love you, Johnny. My, my wife. But I liked it, right? Hey, I'm a nice guy. Skylar, my wife. My, my, what did I say? My wife would agree with you, Roy. Are you in the market for a wife? See, boss, you're not even funny. I, I don't even laugh and I need a job. So I got to pay for these braces, these braces up here. Like, I can't, this looks bad. I think I need bonding. Any dentists in the house? God, if it, get down. Well, Skylar, I'll look into that uh, dentistry for you, but I think you have bigger things to worry about it. Just saying. But you guys, we have, we're talking, uh, oh, recession. Yay, it's here. Is it? And I'm going to show you in gold because you don't know what to do. <laughs> so maybe you do. Yes, I know. Just buy it. Right, right, right. But there's, don't you want to buy it like when it's cheap and then never sell it? Okay, but maybe buy it when it's cheap, sell it when it's expensive, and then buy it when it's cheap again and go buy the things that you want. I mean, at least you want to know, are you getting a discount on money that you're buying to use for stuff while they... Why they while they burn this mother down like the Roman Empire, it's the it's the the politicians. They, they just want to take this whole thing down as per planned, as as you can see. They even tell you this is what we're gonna do. Okay, so first you're gonna lose all your jobs. Well, we told you you were gonna lose your job, and then after you lose your job, uh, we're gonna go into a, a, a probably a depression. But we're just gonna say we did tell you. Like even the Fed's like, yeah, we're going into a recession. Yep. We're definitely going to do that. That way, when they look back, they're like, we clearly told you, even though it was them that created this. But breaking news coming in. Oh my gosh. Hey, Skylar, can you, like, the breaking news is okay. That fire, like, too much. Th thanks, buddy. BlackRock delivers stark warning on U.S. debt default. New economy. I, th I don't think so. I mean, I, I think they'll raise it. I think it's just part of the game. You right? Just like when you vote, it's just part of the game. Like, oh, wow. I'm so glad that you voted in him and not her. And ooh, it, it almost worked this time. It's like in Chicago, right? Uh, Mrs. Lightfoot. And whenever you guys vote in one, you take out another. Just go, like, go to Twitter. You want to see what's going over there? Pray for Chicago. Actually, put in Los Angeles, put in Chicago, put in probably just about any city. It's just like, everyone's like, Hey, you know what? We can kind of just ransack everything and take it all. There is absolutely no consequences and they actually feel bad for us. Crazy. This is what we are living in. Actually, also, I'm kind of curious to see if you guys would be down with the default, J right? Okay, let's, let's see how this plays out. Actually, in the comments section, I would love to know, yes default or no default? Just curious. I have, I'm guessing it's 80% of you are like, yes. That's what we deserve. And then I'm going to tell you, make sure, okay, before you put that in the comment section, do you ever have everything taken care of, right? You're out of a city. I'm not, I need a few more months. Out of a city, fresh water, a garden, you actually have money, things that are real. You have lots of apple trees, orange trees, that's called passive income, right? Where you plant a seed, it takes work. Or you're selling, like you could sell the apples, sell the oranges, sell, right? That's passive income. It just keeps growing forever. Or you could sell things on, online. Which actually, I think that is the only way out of this for you. That, that's it. I mean, swing trading, you know, all that, that's cool and all. Also, you know what, if, if you want, uh, do one day only, this is it, a hundred bucks. If you wanna learn how to sell a product, right? And, and passive income because I think this whole thing is heating up. So my Amazon one, you know, that course almost killed me. For those of you who are like, ha ha ha, scammer selling a course, you go ahead and try it. You launch products every year and tell me how easy it is. It's not gonna be easy, but take, take go ahead, take advantage of it. I'm feeling nice today. A US debt default would threaten a basic anchor of the global financial system and must not happen. BlackRock, Vice Chairman, 
Felipe warned Thursday at the Bloomberg New Economy Gateway. And just even saying that, the new economy. Well, sorry, Felipe, we don't we don't have an economy <laughs> of of goods and services. No, it, we 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 just don't. We have an economy of okay. Let's make GDP go higher. Well. Let's create lots of bonds and then give the people stimulus. But then we got that that pesky inflation thing, right? Right? When you increase money supply, well, th there's different types of money supply. Not like M2, whatever. Let me give you an example. You would probably say gold and silver's money. Well, you're not increasing that supply, are you? You're increasing the debt-based system monetary, the, 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 the bonds. So let's create lots of bonds. And let's create little bonds like these, these guys, the, the, right? Like, oh, lots of bonds. This is debt. It just, and then poof, it actually goes away. But you can actually use that debt or going into a bank. I want a loan right out of thin air. You can actually use that to buy the things that you need to survive when this mother gets burnt down. Or as Ray Dalio says, what do you say, Ray? What do you say, Ray? The financial system will need big restructuring soon. <laughs> yeah, you think? Well, launch a CBDC coming to you in July. As debt burdens become unsustainable, you can go back in the history. It's, it does this every single time. And there are a lot of things that I agree with Ray, and there are a lot that I disagree. So when he's screaming, what over the last two years, cash is trash, and I've been on the other side of that trade. I did very well. But now, is he like, cash is okay? Cash is king? I, I Again, but yes, you're, you're right, Ray. $250,000 that you owe on top of your taxes, and that's going to go up. You're at uh, almost $32 trillion and you're upside down. You're, you're not taxing the people enough, so you got to really get them there, Biden. Because right now, we're, it doesn't, whoever. Like, we're at 120% uh, U.S. federal debt to GDP. You ain't fixing anything above 60, 70. Eh, it's, it's like trying to pee into the ocean to fill it up. And trust me when I say this, the politicians are not here to help you. Never. Not at all. And I don't care. Biden, I'm not... Guys, I have no dog in this fight. It is a bird. You have a left wing and you have a right wing. I don't care. It's the bird that's the problem. The system is the problem. A debt-based system that burdens you with taxes is the problem. And they keep coming up with ways. They're like, well, okay, these people over here will vote for me if we uh, stick it to these people over here, right? That's the game. Let's just be lazy and do it. Nothing. What, were you going to vote for me? All right, you can do that. That's fine. Biden to punish. Perfect example. Now, some of you are like, oh my gosh, this is so frustrating. Biden to punish. Me, you, good credit. Oh, I have a, my FICO score is 850. Oh, that's too bad. Well, we're going to punish you for that. Home buyers, we're now going to subsidize high risk mortgages. So take, for example, California, where you need no down payment. You need nothing. You could just come in. You can have any house you want. Actually, you can have any car you want. You can have anything you want. We'll make Bravo pay for it. And right now, as you may know it, the housing market has been rolling, especially like in California, which I was, you know, 24 months ago, I'm like, peace, right? I'll, I'll, I'll call the top. I'll get out. I did it in 08. And actually, in 08, I even got out of Texas properties. Man, I properties, rentals, all of that. And I buy low and I sell high. And then the politicians will punish you uh, based on taxes, right? You're going to have to, and if you make more, you got to pay more, right? But they will just look for any way they can get you. And that is why I say you, you sell products or you have, you buy land with orchards and you, and you plant seeds and you grow apples and you oranges and you hire people to go sell those things. It's called passive income. And then for all of you that just paid taxes, right? What you want to do is you have a business and you make a hundred thousand dollars, but you have write-offs of a hundred thousand, which basically are what you need anyways to survive home office. We need a home. So we'll write this off and you need a vehicle to write all of these things that you can, you can take that hundred thousand down to zero and go, Oh shoot, I'm broke. And then you don't pay a 38% tax rate. Well, you do a 38% tax rate on zero is zero. If you are a doctor, if you are a lawyer, if you are a fireman, if you're a police officer, you make a hundred thousand or 200,000 or 300,000, 
you got to pay all the taxes. And I was a teacher, university, I I was law enforcement. I, I know, I know the game. And then I'm like, yeah. And then some of you might say, I wish they would have taught me about this in school. Well, that's what I did for 22 years. And the students that listened to me walked away with millions and millions of dollars. So for those of you out there that were in my classes and you listened to what I had to say, how's it feel? So far, the one that I think is in the lead is Jake, who's created Movement Watches. I think he walked away with 300 million. I could be a million, I don't know, something like that. Same process, Create some, have someone create something and sell it. But the whole system wants you to go into the debt and be their servant, right? And work, come, build my, it's my dream, right? That's, that's it. Build my dreams, not yours. Oh, your dreams are weird. They're probably like bravos. But, uh, and then everyone's in debt and now you're stuck with this. Look at this. New buy now, pay later loans. This is exploding. Just in a few months, you got uh, Afterpay, Affirm, PayPal, Zip. Uh, this is 20, wait till you see 2022. This is 2021. From 2020 to 2021 to 2022 to 23, the, these things are ballooning. 46, almost half of it uh, to, to clothe yourself. Because you gotta look cool, right? Big big hat, no cattle, that's kinda how it is. Home decor, what are you guys even doing? Half of it, on clothes, come on. Technology, beauty, uh, groceries. I, I bet you, uh, th th as this chart updates, that's that, that little red bar is gonna get really big. Oh, and for those of you that are wondering, I, I haven't checked it. You're like, how much do they, make? how much can you? Oh, lot, lots, just, to, but you just want to need three grand, five grand, whatever, 10 grand. This guy, uh, this guy's making uh, $20,000 a month, $20,749 every 30 days. But yes, Bravo, what about the product cost? Okay, fine, okay. Five grand goes to that. You're, you're at 15 grand a month. Can, can you live on that? But when you're done with that and you're like, that's not enough though. I got to make more money Then do a pin. Right? How much does it cost to make a pin? I'm guessing not much. How much do they make? Hey, another $9,244 a month. And then we're gonna go for pencils. But Bravo, what if I don't make any money? You're right, you, you might. It, you, that's just how it is. That's why I started ever since I was probably eight selling mistletoe in front of grocery stores. And then I thought, hey, I can actually have one of my friends do this. I wasn't that smart because my f my parents were not financially intelligent. I, this was this is all uh, do it do it yourself. But yes, we are just for the. I'm sure in the Nate the, the guys in the comment section. Oh, uh, great idea! Start a business during a recession. Good job, you know, wise guy. Why don't you get a haircut? Philly Fed. I'm I, yeah. I'll tell you, you're you're not, you maybe you won't make twenty. Maybe you'll make fifteen. Maybe you'll make 10 and start selling pins. Philly Fed Business Survey unexpectedly slumps to worst since Lehman Brothers. So guys, I'm not trying to blow, you know, smoke up your boo ha ha. It's just, it is the way it is. That's okay. But you got to think how much, what's the digits need to be? And I'm, I'm cool. That, that's it. That's what I've done all my life. But I also want to give you the, uh, you know, the, the bad news. It's, it's not as good as it just was but maybe you took advantage of starting businesses years ago when I originally launched the course and you're fine now. You're like, ah, I got it covered. I have everything covered, Bravo, but thank you. Philadelphia Fed Business Outlook. Ta-da, yeah, not, not so good. This is the worst, this is the worst since Lehman Brothers. And the sad news is it's probably gonna get worse and you're probably not going to want to live in those cities <laughs> as it gets worse. Coming in from the hill, recession already here. For many Americans, as buying power, credit, social net shrinks. Well, fix it. Don't think that these guys that are over here are going to fix it for you. They're not. Oh, and just in case you wanted to know that we're in a recession, uh, even though you're, you're like, we're in a recession <laughs> and it's going to get worse. I mean, unless you guys have a solution for this, let's vote someone else in and then we will problem solved. Not at all. U.S. lending here. Here's your uh, economy indicator tumbles for one year, 12 straight months. Recession, well, the Fed told you we're gonna go into one. Just to let you know, I got scared of the word imminent. I did it. Oh, and just to let you know, now we're gonna head over to gold and you guys were asking like, I do, I try to update you on the SPY because I that was the trade I took out on the channel. 
And so far I'm like, what, four for five? Uh, this is the fifth one. I'm down on this last trade, a whole whopping 0.87%. And if you took my swing trading course, you are in it right there. That's where we entered, I did it. I entered and I wrote it all the way up and I then I closed my position for a, a profit. And then I said, eh, I'm gonna wait this one out. I don't think we're getting above that red line. And that was a nine, look at the nine count. After nine, it sells off. What are we at na right now? Eight. So it's like, I got this. But yes, if you are religious and in my swing trading course, also if you want that, all my courses, I mean, Amazon, grab that one, jeez. The other one's 60% uh, off. But again, you really need to start with Amazon. Like, just, you know, it doesn't have to be Amazon. I don't care. Plant fruit trees. Get new new knowledge in, in your in your brain. So we're at eight. You're still holding your position. Just for you people that are in my suit, you can't. You gotta wait for one candle close below the red line. That's my Bravo nine. Even though I closed early, okay, do as I say. <laughs> Not as I did. Actually, look, 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 you still making money. But also talking about money, here is gold. Now, if you want to trade this, I personally, I really, I like just owning it. But I want to, I want to buy it when it's cheap. So, I know you guys are like, never sell, right? I, I have, I, I do have gold and I do have lots of silver and it's just a lot of work to sell it. So, yep, I'm probably like a lot of you. Basically, if I can't click a button on the screen and click buy and sell, I'm like, eh, we'll let that one sit. But I wanna help you because I know there's so much FOMO going on with gold. And I've actually been telling you guys to take profit. If you guys are paper trading this, no financial advice. See, it's just paper trading. Um, this is what's gonna happen. This blue line down here, this is your Fed's funds rate. Uh, you can add it. It's in my courses. I teach you how to add all these things so you can do it all yourself. So I'm, that's a teacher that teaches you this is what you do and don't ask any questions. Any other questions, just Google it. But I've given you guys everything. When you get into this zone, uh, you take your profit and click sell. Um, this blue line, all right, this is a trend line that goes way back to forever. Uh, you're, you're above it so that the trend on gold has been up. Well, actually, since forever, when they tell you this is money, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, sheets of paper, G lots of buying power, and they, they lie to you. That's the whole the whole system. But this is what because you want to know what's going to happen now. Uh, you, what what's going to happen with gold? You have a you have a triple top, one, two, three, three top. That's not good. You're also in uh, your Lux Algo zone. Um, it's going to pull back now for how long and all of that. And you guys want like give me dates, give me exact. This is what happens. You go into a recession. There's a high probability, because that's all I deal with is probabilities, that gold sells off, gold sells off, but then it launches like crazy sauce. But here is how the game is played for now. Fed funds rate. They're going to pause and this little blue line is going to stall. For how long? It could maybe till the end of the year. You'll just see this like, okay, we, we pushed another 25 points. All right. Uh, the whole thing's collapsing. They could, the, the pause may even not even be a pause. It'll just be like frack and cut rates <laughs> because the bond market's already like front run that one. But uh, this, you're gonna have a pause and then it's gonna drop. Then it's gonna be somewhere in that zone that you're gonna wanna be accumulating, not in this zone. So if you want Lux Algo, link in the description, you have to pay for it because things that actually help you in life, you, you gotta pay for. Uh, just like your college degree you're not using. 44 uh, 0.66% on that last dumpster fire from when gold hit in uh, Lux Algo. Uh, this last one that it went into Lux and it went into it now, it's in it. Um, it dropped, uh, what are you down? Uh, currently almost 20%. I'm just, you know, whatever, 19, 20%. Um, the pullback could be worse, but then get ready for the moonshot. Also, if you're like, but Bravo, you are not in Lux Algo. Look, you have, you're, you're just a, a, a pixel away for it. Uh, well, hold on. Let me let me help you with that, Stan. Uh, y you got into it, all right? There was those, those market orders where you're like, I got this. Paper gold is going to the moon. Also, in case you didn't take my bear market course and you're like, well, what's it gonna go down to? How do you trade a triple top? One, two, three, measure from bottom to top, from here, down here. Let me just kind of ballpark it for you, just in case. Now I know you guys are like, oh my gosh, Bravo said uh, uh, gold's going to zero. Um, no, I'm not, I'll be buying it. <laughs> just like, and I have it right now. Uh, it's guess, guess where it's gonna go. Oh, look, look-see, 
exactly on the trend line. I would actually be at uh, 1,500, but I'm not saying that. Well, also, you again, did it break? Is it confirmed? No, it's not. You just have a triple top. Now you just got to break that little line right there. And then once you break that line, it's confirmed. And then it's even more confirmed when it breaks it, comes up, tests it, which you would already know because you took advantage, and then it drops lower. But Bravo, you don't understand. I was just on Mike Maloney's channel, Peter Schiff's channel. Like, what do they sell? Oh, oh I, I don't, they teach out? No, I, I, I don't know what they sell. Um, they, they said every time, gold has usually been positive during recessions. Okay, cool. That's great. Again, no dog in this fight. I just, I don't want you buying tops please. And if you would like help with not buying tops, at least subscribe. Come on. Come on, Skylar. Hit, hit me up. Can, can you hear me? Skylar, you there? Thank, thank you, Sky. See, the, the guy earns his keep. But fought, like, just click the subscribe button. We'll, we'll hang out together. I'll, you don't have to buy a course. No, nope, you just come here for the yuck yucks and some knowledge, even though it's, I know it's painful to, to swallow there, John. I'm pretty sure it's hard for your wife to swallow too. I'm talking about like the, the stuff that I'm saying, not, not you, John. All right, guys, I do. I, I love you guys. I, I want you, I want to help you. <laughs> Can I please? All right. If not, all right. Well, let's, I hope you enjoyed the yuck yuck and I will, uh, I'll see you tomorrow.